Dave Corkell, Managing Director of uh, CSIS Limited. We're a UK based company and we're just setting up in the States and this is our fir first trade show and uh, we're selling uh, rapid deployment cameras. So what do you got here for me today? You've got a 360 degree camera here which has basically a camera which has mounted in a stainless steel case. You've got in here a router, battery, and you can set up between Wi-Fi connectivity or mobile telephone system. 12 volts is su uh, support, which can be from a solar or a wind turbine or reusable energy such as uh, fuel cells, etc. As you can see, all you do is switch it on and it hooks up to the CSIS Connect and anywhere in the world you've got connectivity by using a web browser. Images can be displayed on iPad, smartphone and you simply log in And that's how quick we just logged in to the HTTP and we're now monitoring live images directly from the camera here. That's a simple solution to a complex system. You can set up areas in the, in the picture so that you can have pixel boxes so you can track people coming in, send emails out when there's an area of, of interest that's been uh, encroached and therefore immediately there's no pan and tilting with this because you're looking at panning everything at once so with megapixel technology that which we're using we have a, a very safe system and this is a, a, a pretty unique lens uh, 180 degrees Hundred, yeah we put two of these together with this one to get 180 degrees and with this one we've got 360 degrees We call it the CSIS torch camera. This is the pixel boxes that you can set up. And you can see that's 180 degrees now, scanning that area. We can and that's the 360 degree image. So if that was hanging up, you can see the total area. What we can also do is correct it. So we've now corrected that image under software. So all distortion has been removed. But you can see we've now got that total area. You could see I've got full control of the camera remotely. And I've got the same with that. That's the picture of our estate in, in the UK. And we're monitoring everything live over the mobile network now.